nice spring weather. Love it. Snowing Got in mid-April, early yeah. April. Yeah. So what are we doing today? Oh well, I'm gonna bring the water down from our uh, upper spring catchment down to the property so that we can start having water uh, for the cows, for the chickens, you know. Yeah, it's gonna start warming up here. I know since it's snowing, it doesn't look like it, but it is, it's warming up. And yep. um, I wanna move the cows out of their current winter pasture to their holding area so that their their field can grow up. I, I want the grass to grow in there and not have them walking around. So, but in order to move them, we need to be able to get water to where they're gonna be. So this is step one in doing that. And then uh, obviously- Step two, because I didn't show you step one. In the previous video we did where I reconnected our spring back up to bring the water to the catchment. Now we got to uh, blow the pipes out so is that uh, the water will come down to us because usually the sediment at the bottom of our, our spring, you know. That you watched us muck out last fall. <laughs> yeah, gets in our pipes and then we can't have the water down here. So I got my trailer loaded up here with our compressor and we're going to uh, blow out the pipes. And then you don't have blow to out the muck. haul water to the chickens anymore. Yes, it's such a pain. All right, off to it. Well, just gonna make sure the air tank is full of Lots of pressure here, which it looks like we are. And then I'll get my hoses and uh, run it down to our uh, outtake, I guess. I don't know what it's called. We'll blow it out. comes out of the ground rooster saying hello um, where the hose comes out of the ground from the spring up above so he's gonna blow everything out so that the water can flow but that's where it's located all right well this is where the water comes down the gully from up the hill and then uh, I added this little contraption piece on so I can put the compressor up to it uh, and then we have a couple different valves. This is just, you know, extra hoses. And uh, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put our compressor and push 100 PSI of air up the hill and try to get our water flowing. Okay. Got the air going up the hill. Give it a few minutes to do its thing. Then we'll take the air compressor off and uh, see if we have water action. Always so nice to have water at your fingertips. Yes. But still cold out at night a little bit. Yeah, our, obviously the concern is, is that we don't want all our pipes to freeze because we open it up too early. But it's still mostly underground right here, so. If we at least get the water down here, then we're set up for when warmer days to come. Yeah, that'll be nice. Mm -hmm. Which is coming soon. Not too many cold nights. Nope. Or at least that's what we tell ourselves. Yes, hopefully, right? All right no more air going here, so I gotta get back to work. Okay. <laughs> we just missed this hose. Flinging around like a crazy person as water and air went spurting out of it. I ran shrieking up the hill. <laughs> freaked me out. I, I didn't want to get wet. It was like uh, a medusa coming out of the ocean, flinging itself around. But anyway. Uh, you can hear the bubbling in there. Maybe water's coming, maybe not. It's going it? to shoot you right in the eyeball. Uh, we'll see. I don't think so. Probably got to do that one more time. One or two more times. 
Gurgle, gurgle. I'm so afraid it's gonna hit me. Ooh. It won't come out that fast. Might still be frozen underground. All right, well, we pressurized it and now we're gonna release the Kraken, I guess. Yeah, hold on to that thing tight. It's go. sprayed before. Now I just have to wait a minute. You see all the dirt get blown out. <laughs> don't That's don't look don't there. put that in your face. It's going to spray your face off. Well, I'm going to go uh, get the pressure tank pumping up again because usually you got to do that one or two times before we really get any get any flowage, so I'll be right back. Flowage? Yeah. Where the magic happens. Remember I was down in there in the fall? If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. I was down in that hole. Yeah, good times. Well, no luck. Just a little bit too early. Too early pipes are still frozen a bit so we'll try again soon but that should help things out anyway to get things blown out a yeah. bit and no. stir the ice up maybe probably this week it says it's supposed to be around 10 degrees up here so awesome all right well anyway we're on our way yeah off to the next activity